guys, it's me, Avalonia. I'm back again with a new video and as I promised, it is Wednesday and it's time for the Wednesday tutorials. And today we will make mini pocket letters. I already said you in my last video and we'll make it short. We will make these ones, the four pocket, mini pocket letters and these three ones. And you, what you need for this is a normal sized pocket letter page or the card collector pages and a really sharp scissor. You can also cut these with your paper trimmer, but it's a little bit tricky because it flaps away and things like that. And that's why I always use my scissors. Um, there are two options you can cut these uh, pocket letter pages. Um, it is a little bit th that way how you want your pocket letters. If you just want three pockets and not the four pockets, you just need to cut your page in three parts. But I like the four pocket pages as much as the four pockets. And that's why I will show you the second way, um, but it's also like the, the first way a little bit and I will show you. So we will cut the four pages and three pocket pages in one. So you need your, your pocket letter page and you need to check out the right size um, by putting your fingers in. Yeah, because you need this side, the open side, looking upwards to you front in front of you <laughs> because um, I had a mistake already uh, that I didn't look right and it was the wrong side and I cut it yeah I cut it uh, wrong and it was all open and that's this this is not what we want okay so you check out okay it's open the fingers goes in there and then you take your scissor and you will cut exactly underneath the glued line here, you know. If you cut these, you really your your scissors need need really to be sharp. It's really important, and it's really tricky to see because it it shines always. But you also, if your scissors are really sharp, you you will notice when you cut into this glued line because it's a little bit harder to cut. It's not so easy. Just a little bit, but you will you will feel it. And then you cut straight across underneath this fused line, and then come to the end. And then you have your three pocket mini pocket letter. I always cut the edges here and round it up a little bit because it looks a little bit better. And yeah, that's the three one. And if you want another free one, you just need to cut right underneath the this line here. Yeah, but we will also want a four pocket one. And then you take it, this, uh, this side is the outside and you will cut um, straight on this line. Really be carefully that you don't cut into the glue lines. Try to cut as straight as you can. And then... Oh, Very tricky at the moment, the light is not so good. Okay, then you have the four pocket one. And... These ones are left and these are no pockets anymore because they are open on one side. But what I do, I cut them also in two pockets. And then you have two diff you have some different options what to do with them. You can use if you have a fuse tool, you can glue them together, fuse them together. I don't know what it's called can use a fuse tool and glue them together. You have one pocket for some goodies to send or something. 
you can also use your sewing machine. I use my sewing machine because I love the look of these uh, zoot um, edges. It looks so shabby and if you use some colorful string it also looks so absolutely cute. You can also make two different ones or three different lines and leave it a little bit hanging and I will show you some samples tomorrow. Um, and you can also make from these little sheets um, mini mini pocket letters. I will show you tomorrow because I will also make some. I also bought me this golden thread to make some Christmas ones. Yay! It's cute. It's golden. As you see, awesome. Thought would be cute to use in Christmas projects. And I will make some teeny tiny mini mini pocket letters for you and I will show you. It's not it's a little bit tricky because um it's really tiny, but it looks so cute. I have seen them on a Facebook group and I will definitely try this out. And yes, I will make them and I will use my sewing machine for this because I don't have a fuse tool. You can also use your hot glue gun to glue them together. And you can also... Uh, okay, I won't say that because I don't know the English name for it. Um, so use your glue gun. Um, the tip of the glue gun will also glue these together. As you use um, some, some paper underneath... You can glue them together. It doesn't make any um, any bad things. <laughs> it works. I already tried this out on my mini sticker. Um, my mini stickers I made. I also used my hot glue gun because I don't have a fuse tool. So that's the way you can make these cutie cutie tiny mini pocket letters. I will also have some more mini pocket letters to show you tomorrow because I will make more. I already started and they are absolutely different to my Shabby Chic ones. They are different themes. And don't miss it. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.